Hi, I'm Lauren Parker, and we're talking about etching circuit board patterns into uh, copper material, or etching artwork patterns into copper material. And so I've got this taped down nice and tight, except for this one little corner right here. than heat and pressure. I just measured the temperature of my iron. It's around 300 degrees, which is ideal. And I'm going to go directly down onto this transfer paper, and I'm going to just go ahead and press nice and hard and just bear down on it, make sure that I'm getting the full heat in that area. And what I'm doing is I'm causing the toner to stick just in that corner at first. And by doing that corner first, then I have a little, I have a little placement guide. Yeah, I can feel it. It's starting to stick. So now I know if I, if I loosen this up, loosen up my taping, then the rest of the pattern will orient itself to that stuff that's already stuck down. So now it'll flatten itself out really well. So there we go. So now it's going to stay really well because this is actually sticking to the copper. So now to get the rest of the pattern, I'm going to go ahead and put a layer of typing paper in between just to help me out. And it just helps even the heat out. And my iron at about 300 degrees, which is the linen setting on this iron, I need to go ahead and apply a lot of pressure and even heat. And I just kind of rock it back and forth. This helps prevent it from sticking to the press and peel material itself, but also it's just an easier surface to press down on and drag the iron across. I need to do this for about three minutes.